Garnet Hill has been home to St. Aloysius College since 1866. Inside, this hall has hosted parents' evenings, Christmas concerts, gym classes, end of term dances, circuit training, race nights, plays, school orchestra evenings. Since 1925, it's tried to be everything to everyone. And it's still in use today. But all that is about to change. You had to endure the cold wind that met you as you uh, went from the changing room to the shower block and back again. In terms of a, a gym, for example, it was a cupboard with some weights in it. This place is going to have a whole dance studio, it's going to have strength and conditioning areas, it's going to have a full-size basketball court. I get to school quite early so I'll be able to go and do stuff before school and then after school as well. In a way I regard this as unfinished business and when I came to the college, it was obvious that needed to be the next step, not only for the fantastic facilities it'll provide for our young people, um, but also for the space it'll provide in the school afterwards and the opportunities to, to move other things around and, and create better facilities for our young people. Oh, you can't, words can't describe it, I think it'll be unreal. There's a dance studio, there's a fitness suite, there's a full-size sports hall. Um, there can be a whole range of things going on at the same time, I hope, all throughout the day. There's an advantage to having the sports facilities right on your doorstep. Having the sports hall right across, like right next to the school, will be a lot easier for pupils to manage their studies and their fitness training. Rather than having to take a 30-minute bus journey to get out to wherever you play your sport. In my subjects, I felt like you know, if I wanted to do something, I was going to do it. And I feel like that kind of stemmed from sport. We played at uh, Murrayfield, and rugby was a sort of bond that brought us together. But to this day, we're all best of friends, and uh, you know, that's really, really special for us. To make this a reality, obviously, um, we require support. Well, this isn't about paying for school fees. It's about making the contribution to expose your children to something that you might otherwise have to go and pay for elsewhere. For the college to embark on this project has been a bit of a leap of faith. Um, we have a, a lot of money in place but we don't have it all um, and I suppose I'm really asking for the help of the Aloysian community to make this dream a reality after 20 years. In 2016, this lovely old hall will have helped create generations of sporting heroes. Now, you have the chance to do the same. Will you? VR. Sporting hero.